We're sitting in um, our peer gallery. It's called Peers Through the Years, and we wanted to tell the story of all the peers. It's only recent history that our peers are uh, recreational peers. In the beginning, all our peers were purely industrial. Our very first peer in 1889 was known as the railroad peer. And it was, it was designed basically to take a train out on Tampa Bay, pick up building materials and people, bring them into the city, as well as take cargo out, like oranges, cattle, that type of stuff. And then someone came the idea of, hey, let's sit on this pier and fish. And next thing you know, more people fished and they didn't want you to fish on it. And then they realized, we're not going to stop these folks. So let's try and make some money off of it. And they, they built all kinds of bathing pavilions and one thing led to another. And now we have the pier that we have today. Probably since 19, uh, the early 1920s, they've always been the iconic element of the city. Um, they've always been the gathering place, the entertainment venue. It is a very cool history of, of, the, of all the piers, including some artifacts. In 1967, when they were uh, demolishing the structure of the Million Dollar Pier, he literally walked out there and asked if he could have them, and they gave them to him. So he ended up donating them to the museum. So those are the original light sconces that were at the entrance of the Million Dollar Pier. So you, you get to see not only these huge, beautiful photographs of, of piers of the past and understand why we had piers, but you actually get to, to actually see some of the actual history from these great buildings that were here.